Hey guys, live with the Pontiff. Live, live with the Poontiff, the Poonami Teeth. Don't mind a bit of Poonami myself there. I don't mind a bit of Poonami, bit of Poonami. Ah, uh, guys, what can I say? What can I say indeed? What can I say? And I gotta tell you, man, gotta, 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 gotta tell you, I've been working very hard, man. I've been working hard, and um, just got a coffee coming, being delivered. Thank you, thank you. Here we go, coffee delivered. Coffees for closers, for closers. Um, I've actually been working on my my channel there. I've got a lot of paid reviews out of the way, and the the good thing is they're done. They're done and dusted. I did a lot of paid reviews, and I've actually sent out follow up emails to people to say, hey, your videos on YouTube. So. You know, I've, I've given them good customer service and I've done a bit of marketing because when I've sent this letter out, I've obviously said, hey guys, you want to support me on Patreon? Hey guys, do you want to make a quick PayPal donation? Hey guys, I need your help. So, uh, I, I, I think it was very cool. Let's get Blue Shirt Buddha. Blue Shirt Buddha. Let's get him on here now. I wanted to do a show with the Blue Shirt Buddha. Buddha. I wanted to get the Buddha, the Buddha guy on, and uh, maybe we'll get showcase, showcase watches on as well. He's pretty cool. Uh, let's get the, let's get it out. They got a couple minutes to get in before we open the floodgates. How's the coffee? Nespresso. It's Nespresso. I'm gonna close my door. And. Um, I gotta tell you guys, the weight loss is working. Look at this, the weight loss, the weight loss. I mean, seriously, this suit didn't fit. Now it keeps falling off me. And this is this belt. It was on. It didn't fit me. Now I come on the last notch, and it's falling off. So man, the weight loss. Those tapeworms are working. Ah. Uh, Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Thank you, Yankee Doodle, two dollars. We needed a super chat. How much to take your pants down and play the flute? Ha 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 ha! Thank you very much there. So guys, gotta tell ya, it's all very exciting. I um, I want to move on with my life. I'm thinking about thinking about buying a sports car again. Uh, Victor's come back. Yeah, I've had depression. Any chance of a donation? Any chance of a donation? There we go. Please, donation, please. PayPal to Archie Luxury seventy two. There we go. Yeah, I I've got to get some grammatical errors here. Someone said to me, "Hey, how come I've sent this out? I've had depression." There we go. Sent. We got Blue Shirt Buddha. Just hang on, Blue Shirt. I got to plug my mic in because you're now on, and it's going to have feedback. Here we go, Blue Shirt Buddha, how are you? I'm good, Pat, how are you? Hey, you know, ups and downs, ups and downs, very quickly, super chat there, M Paul M, five pounds, have a wheel nut, thank you, Paul, and P Peter Richard, two pounds, keep up the walking, it's working, it's walking and diet, and also, um, I gotta tell you, man, I gotta tell you, I got a secret ingredient, and we'll, we'll talk about that later, mm -hmm. uh, in down the track. But basically, guys, I gotta tell you this, man. You gotta be fit. Here we go. Hello, Manti. Five dollars. I blame you for overpriced Rolex at the moment, Paul. How overvalued is Rolex at the moment? 
hey man, it's the Chinese. The Chinese have bought it. And you can't blame them. It's a good investment. It's a good investment. So don't be blaming anyone. You New Zealanders, you blame everyone. Blame your own. Blame your own country. You know that? You guys there, you, you pissed off the Americans. You didn't want their nuclear vessels docking in, at port. Wait till China comes by and repossesses you guys. Then, uh, who, you, then, who, then who are you going to call? Don't yeah, call who are you going to call, man? They're all big toughies. Oh, I'm a toughie. We're New Zealanders. Blame someone else. Yeah, yeah. So, so what? Don't forget what happened in the in the World War Two. Okay. Right. The Brits aren't going to help you. They're lousy. The lousy Poms. They're not going to help you. Exactly. So, blue shirt Buddha. Yep. I got to yep. tell you, man. Um, are you a Trumpster? I am, of course. Yeah, I'm getting a bit worried. Someone, a good friend of mine who's a huge Trumpster, said he didn't think Trumpster was going to win the election. What's your view? Well, that's what I thought the last time, and look what happened. By the way, guys, if you super chat me $20 now, I will have a cigar on air. Nice. I will have a, I've got a, uh, this is a very nice Cohiba little mini cigar. I will smoke that on air. Super chat me. Make it $10. Come on, guys. Work with me, not against me. I've got these from the cigar shop. Also, I'm out of whiskey. If any of you guys could get some whiskey from Dan Murphy's, I don't care what it is, man. I am dry. Okay? And a dry pontiff is no fun. It's no fun. No fun. Um, i got to tell you, seriously... I hope. Look, I'm not. I'm not. I actually hate both sides of politics. I, I must admit, mm. my heroes in the American political system. I'm a huge Richard Nixon fan. Mm -hmm. and, I, and I mean that I honestly. I think Richard Nixon yeah. did a lot of good things policy-wise. He was, he was in some ways. He was, he was a bit naive. Okay. He was and a bit paranoid, but his, his biggest mistake yeah, which was, was his own undoing, you know. And then people around him did. Some Something really stupid, and yes. um, yet again, I was a huge Reagan fan. Yes, absolutely. Um, I got to tell you, I I think with the the first George W. Bush, I didn't mind. Mm -hmm. The second, uh, he was on the stink. Mm -hmm. And then I got to be completely honest with you, I was really happy that they had a black man in the office. I actually did like Obama. Oh. Well, there's, there's but, where we part, part ways. Okay, right? now the problem with Obama is he couldn't What's get that? anything passed. He couldn't get anything passed. He couldn't... You know what I mean? He... I, I certainly know. I, it was the worst... Some of the worst years here in the United States on, under that man. Now, i, I got to be honest. I don't know if it was necessarily his... Fault. Okay, ten dollars. Henlo Mayanti, ten dollars. New Zealand, smoke that cigar, make. Embrace the third position, Paul, and leave us Kiwis alone. We ridden, with, we 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 ridden with Biden. Okay, one minute. I gotta get my ashtray. If you don't mind, I go. Could you just cover me, blue shirt? I gotta go and I got a Cohiba ashtray that's got water in it. I got to empty it out, and we can have the smoke. All right. Does that sound fair? fair? Just, just yeah. cover me for uh, just a minute there. Just, just, just be a minute. So what's up, guys? Loudmouth Tim. How's it going? Watch and pray. Showcase. Hop on here, man. Help me out. James Con Eleven, Mark P. Good to see all you guys. What do you guys want to talk about? Yeah, once again, Brian Allison, left to my own, uh, left to my own volition here. Hey, Logan Hall, good to see you. Yes, I, I, I got, I got you, Rancher. I got you. I got you. Yeah, he did it again. Watches and giggles. He certainly did. What's up, everybody? Uh, let's see how long it takes him this time. Uh, wristwatch check. I'm wearing my uh, my speedy man on the moon today. Okay, I'm back in the saddle. Sorry about that, blue shirt. Mm -hmm. Hello, blue shirt. Blue shirt. So at the I'm moment, there. I have no girlfriend. I I, I am. <laughs> Let me just clarify. 
my status there in case there are any potential suitors out there. So I am officially on the market again. Okay. Oh, okay. I am we... technically married. Let me just clarify. I just want to clarify this because I got into trouble last time. Right. I am technically married. I'm in a sexless marriage, which is more of a marriage of convenience because the lady I married has a rather large trust fund, which I don't want to be excluded from. Mm. I don't and blame. my children, I don't want them being removed from the inheritance state because it's all about the money. Well, it's always about the money. You got a Yankee Doodle super chat. Yankee Doodle super chat there. Why is hydroxychlorine being held back as a cure for COVID? This is outrageous. Four dollar drug. Hey man, capitalism, capitalism. It's it's many of these things are held back because greedy pharmaceutical companies. That's the reason. I have no. I'm not a chemist, mm. but um, look, man, it's just how it goes. Now I got to tell you very quickly. The reason I'm having the cigar on air is because I officially don't have a girlfriend. And somebody paid you for it. Of course. But the thing is, girlfriends, they hate you smoking cigars. They yes. really hate They really hate it, man. They hate it when you smoke. So because I'm in between, I can smoke <laughs> all the cigars I like. Very nice. And once I'm in a relationship, I say that, no, I don't smoke. Mm -hmm. So I, I'm not, I don't smoke every day. I, I can't afford that. I can't afford that. Right. But I, I do like a good cigar. Do you like mm -hmm. a cigar, Blue Shirt? Every now and again. With a cocktail. Mm. Not often, but every now and again. Ah, it's just delightful. Very, delightful. very delightful. So there we go. It's a Cohiba. It's a little Cohiba. If you want to buy me some, guys, I'm happy to accept cigars and smoke them on air. I don't mind. <laughs> Remember, there's no calories in smoking. True, very true. Mind you, the lung cancer can be a bitch, but hey, that doesn't kick in for about 20 years. Mm. I so gotta tell you, seriously, I'm between yeah. birds at the moment. Mm -hmm. The girlfriend is officially no longer mine. I'm sorry. That's okay. The wife, that's a no-go zone. That's a, that's a, that's a tax write-off. The, right. the wife is a tax write-off. Mm -hmm. uh, that's why I'm allowed to stay here. I've got to do certain, by the way, I've got to do certain repairs to the place. That's part mm -hmm. of the agreement. Mm -hmm. I'm actually having the whole place renovated. You know that carpet? Mm -hmm. uh, Guess just, what? Uh, just so you know, Archie. Suck a hole. Suck a hole. I got to tell you, cigar and coffee in the morning, what a way to go. Not a bad I, way to start your day. I used to smoke Henry Winterman Cafe Creams. They were mm -hmm. just a mild Dutch, a Dutch cigar. They're a dry cigar. You don't need a humidor for them. They're a bit, a bit savage. But I used to love a Henry Winterman and a coffee mm -hmm. in the morning. Cafe nice. Creams. I got to tell you, so I'm between birds at the moment. Right. I'm officially on the market. Mm -hmm. I'm losing the weight. What I want to lose is? another 10 kilos. I think I'll be killer. Okay. Okay. And I got to be honest with you. I only like Asian women. Mm -hmm. I would That's prefer totally someone with a master's or a PhD level. Right, doctor. A doctor would be good. Would be good. Mm -hmm. Doesn't have to be a GP doctor. Like a medical doctor can be right. a right. An Doctor astrophysicist, astrophysicist, engineer, or you know, rocket scientist, something like mm -hmm. that. It'd be good if they were a millionaire. I'd really, really find that kind of cool. <laughs> I'd like them to also have a Mercedes or a sports car that mm -hmm. I could occasionally drive. Mm -hmm. Garlic breath. Garlic breath. And I would honestly give them the time of their life. Okay? Okay. Sounds good I'm to me. I'm just going to wait until I lose a little bit more weight. Then I'm going to apply my trade. Here we go. Indian information, two dollars. Racist comments by loudmouth need to be reported. What, what racist comments? I don't know. We don't really like racism. You know that I hate all races equally as much, especially the Ukrainians who I just cannot stand. Right. Or the Germans. The Germans. Can I tell you a story about my grandfather? Many years ago, my mm -hmm. grandfather, 
So he was a Russian soldier. So the right. Russians were on the British side and the American mm -hmm. side for you people out there. He was captured by the Germans. Mm -hmm. And he went to a POW camp. Yeah, that's rough. Anyhow, he had a neighbor who was Latvian. Mm -hmm. Latvia, that's the Baltic states, very yep. close to Ukraine. Okay. Mm -hmm. They got completely shit faced one day. Right. And the Latvian guy reveals he was also in the army. Mm -hmm. He was in the Latvian SS. Oh, lovely. Oh, oh, that, yeah. and he still had the uniform. That did not go no. over well. They were going to kill each other. The police were called. <laughs> right. Wow. But yeah. I got to tell you seriously. Mm -hmm. I think for me, I'm going to take a break from women for the moment. Good for you. St I'm going to get myself fit. Focus on steel sports. Steel sports. I'm going to get myself dump, fit. Dump one of those one of those paddocks and get steel sports. And you know what I want to buy too? I want to get a little Mayada. Okay. Or an MR2. All right. Just to piss off Clive. I'd love to get an MR2, <laughs> you know? He's in the peanut gallery, so we heard that. I'd love to. I, honestly, I want to get a series... <sighs> I want the Australian compliant. I don't want the turbo. I don't like. The, I never like turbo engines. Yeah, you don't need a turbo. Uh, and, and that's just a that's just a big repair waiting to happen. Exactly. So I'm going to sell one of my paddocks, mm -hmm. get an MR2 or a Miata. Man on the moon. And a Miata man! What do you think of that as an idea? Well, that sounds like an excellent idea. I just got to slow down a bit because at the moment. I'm a little bit my, my depression and and you know manic and I just got to make sure I don't blow the money mm -hmm. on stupid things you know yeah don't don't do that don't do that uh, oh by the way the carpet beetles they're going to be solved you know what don't tell them mm -hmm. I'm ripping up the wool carpets next yes, week we found out that out last night and you know what what synthetic carpets the carpet beetles. You're finally joining the, the rest of the civilized world with synthetic yeah. carpet. What do you think of that? But synthetic car the problem with synthetic is it actually can be a fire hazard. You know that? Ah, it's, uh, the stuff is all treated now. It's all flame retardant. Mm. Yeah. Is that right? They oh, said yeah. the same thing about asbestos. <laughs> the miracle fire. You remember fire. that shit? I do. I do. Mm. I'm older than you. That was five. a miracle building product, asbestos. It certainly was. Yep. Let's talk watches. Come on, guys. Get the watch talk happening, man. Yeah. Mr. C, one dollar. Mm -hmm. Let's get whist watch talk. I tell you one thing I've been deciding to do is, can I ask you this? Okay, I've got two yeah. paddocks, 251 set 27s. Right, dump one. I, okay, let me tell you. I've got one that has got the 315 movement. That's a lower beat. Right. And it's rhodium plated white gold. Mm -hmm. And I've got one that was one year later, which is... Right the newer movements got the three two four movement mm -hmm. it's a higher beat version of the other movement right 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 the the newer one doesn't have papers it's got an extract right the older one has paper which one should i sell <clears throat> <sighs> or, or maybe list both and sell one yeah you could do that I, I mean i would tend to keep the older lower beat one but it being rhodium plated, that that's the one thing that concerns me about Actually, that. Actually, it looks better. The rhodium plating looks better. Right, it but eventually better. you're going to have to have it replated eventually. Yes, but when you service it by paddock and you're not uh -huh. taking any metal off, you're putting... They do that for you? Well, you've got to pay for it. Nothing's right, free, of course. sunshine. Of course. Jesus. Of course. I mean, we're, we're capitalists. Yeah, Here no, we go. No, nobody's Indian surprised. information, five bucks. Loudmouth said Obama spent like a black man. Please report and ban... Please remove his wench and report and ban. Feel sorry for 350 body of... Okay, I don't think he meant it that way. i got to be honest with you. A lot of black men I know are very responsible, okay, with yeah, money. i got to tell you, I listened to Dave Ramsey. There's a guy there, Hogan's his name, big guy. Mm -hmm. Very good financial advice. So I, mm -hmm. I would say spending money like a black man, nothing wrong with that. I... I've actually got some very close friends who are, who are colored. Well, so what? So what? Spend money. Uh, I know a lot of black men who are very responsible. Why don't, why don't we just stick to watches and, and yeah, this skip, not, this skip not, all over that? Skip so, all that there. Because I tell you honestly, mm -hmm. 
I've got friends of mine. I know one guy who I didn't know was black. He's a really good fan of mine. Mm -hmm. And I don't give a shit what color you are. Does it doesn't matter? Doesn't make any difference. Does no. it matter? You got a rooted rotor super chat. Rooted rotor super chat two dollars. Arch, get the rhodium dial yachty. Stealthy and sexy. Bit expensive. Mm. See the speedy. I can get for half the price of the the yachty. Correct. And the speedy's just so cool. It's it's iconic. your bod NYX two dollars. What's worse, a fake Rolex, a fake Rolex of a fake marital status. <laughs> And A. Reedy, $2. Why is Milgo so unloved? The Harry Potter sec. Uh, Milgaus is a fantastic Milgaus is loved. I, I didn't think they're unloved. Who said they're no. unloved? Where yeah. Where are they unloved? Where? Where, 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 where? Because when I want to buy one, they're bloody expensive. Where are they unloved? Tell me that. Tell me that. Exactly. The, the one case you could possibly make for that is that maybe the white dial Milgaus which is now discontinued, was unloved at the time when it was produced. I, I think it's got huge potential, the white it does, dial. Absolutely. And it's I'd a buy a white watch. dial any any day of the week. Why not? Yeah, I love the white, the white dial and the black dial that you had are my favorites. I'm yes. not so crazy about the, the green colored glass, but the, the Z Blue is okay. Mm. But it's a fantastic watch. It's I'd love any Milgaus. I would love it. The problem is they're expensive. That, that, that's the problem with the Milgaus. The only problem I see is they're dear. That's why um, I'm going to get the Speedy. Right. I mean, if you're talking unloved, then you, you're talking the uh, the Air King. But uh, I don't think... I like the, the Air King. The Air yeah. King is another great watch. I, I, it I is. don't have a problem with it. It is. If I had the choice, though, between an Air King and a Milgaus, I'd definitely take the Milgaus. If you had a choice of an Air King or a White Dial Milgaus, what would you pick? White Dial Milgaus. Mm. Air King or a Green Black? A GV Black mm. Dial. So I'd probably and go for the Air King. Yeah, then Air I'm King going is for a great watch. King. Yeah, it is. It is really, it is really. I had one for a short time. I know you did. Great, great, great watch. Yeah, that. it looked fantastic. And, um, but if I had my choice between Air King and Explorer, Explorer all the way. Oh yes, yes, you're right. Explorer, the Air King is slightly have... bigger, forty mil. The Explorer is thirty nine, but I think thirty nine. Uh, yeah, cares? what difference does it make? The Explorer can do everything so perfectly. Hey, that's exactly watch. what I said in my first marriage. What difference does it make? It obviously, <laughs> the Explorer can be a sports watch, can be a dress watch. It does. No, everything. I said one mil, one mil. What difference can that make? What? She said it. <laughs> Anyhow, the thing is, I got to tell you, man. I honestly think. Uh, here we go. Showcase watches two pounds. Speedy going high soon. Arch three eight six one movement coming. I don't know if they will really go that high. There's so many of them. I mean, <laughs> come on. I I don't even mind the broad arrow. You know, from the early two thousand. I 2000s. love the broad arrow. That's a great looking watch. Like they're a bit of a sleeper. They're not really they that loved. Mm-hmm. Right, and you find a deal on them. I also, I'm a really big fan of the first Omega in space. I love that. Mm, little, little, little small for me, but you know what I also like? Mm-hmm. What's that? Speedmaster reissue Mark II. Mm, yes. Very seven. I, I like it with the, the racing orange. Mm-hmm. I reckon that might be a better buy because that's a column wheel chronograph. Right. It's coaxial movement. Mm-hmm. I reckon that could be the... I might get one of those. Because they're yeah. a bit unloved. Mm -hmm. They are. you you got to remember, a lot of these speedies, um, I I kind of... I think Omega makes some fantastic pieces. Omega is a great brand. Okay, Yankee Doodle, $2. BMW now making plastic transmissions. Wow. <laughs> Good one, Yankee. I got to tell you, I think um, the other thing is, you know, what about getting a Zenith El Primero again? Would that be a cool watch to have? So this is for I'm rebooting my midlife crisis. Right, I'm officially, right. I'm actually getting them. I'm going to get the sports car, mm -hmm. the sports watch, mm -hmm. lose weight. I might even dye my hair. Do you think I should have a blonde tinge through it? What do you reckon? Uh, no. 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 no, no, no. You're approaching fifty. No, <laughs> definitely not. Fifty's the new forty. Yeah. Still, 
Do you reckon I should shave my hair completely, get completely bald, or just be a fat? <laughs> Only no? if somebody pays you for it. Only if somebody <sighs> pays you. So if you want to see Archie bald, I don't know, five hundred bucks. Five hundred US. Five hundred US. Five hundred US. It's done. Believe you, you me, go. no problems at all. Done and dusted. Done and uh, dusted. If I gotta really... tell you, mm -hmm. what else do you reckon you should buy? Non Rolex. What's a good sports like I? W would I go Pam? Would you go Pam, or no. that's too cliched? No. no, I would not go Pam. I, okay. I, you know, I don't know. Do you, do Breitling. You know How about Breitling Super Ocean Heritage? Mm, yeah, but good value, bang per it, buck. It is. It is. It's, it's an excellent watch. Uh, would you want to go back to your Breguet? That Type Twenty was oh. so beautiful. I do I mean, it on a leather. A, I don't really. Yeah. Uh, the bracelet I never really enjoyed. It was yeah, no bracelet. Do, that's the one it. watch that belongs on leather, and you can get a. There are good deals on them out there. You can get them for five thousand US, and on. Yeah. Oh, and four thousand US. Yeah. Four thousand yeah. yeah. Turkey Vulture, two dollars. Pontiff Grabber two one four two seven zero again, and get a red Miata. So that's a Explorer one thirty nine. Yep. And he's yep. got. Look at look at look at his avatar. Look at that with the blue loom. Mm -hmm. Man, that is. Very sexy. Well, well it's yep. a very sexy watch. It's a great watch. It's, I, I I love mine. I have. Uh, the problem is, mm -hmm. they're expensive. See, in my country, that is a ten thousand dollar Aussie watch. Right. I can get the Speedy for about five. Right. Okay. Is 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 the Explorer One double the Ooh. Speedy? I mean, the Speedy Moon on the Moon. That's my signature watch, man. Correct. Correct. If. For your first steel sports, going back into steel sports, you need to get the Speedy. I already have a steel sports. No, the the, the JLC. The the, the JJ. That's Lecruz. steel sports, isn't it? It was made for polo no. players. Right. How it's much more sporty can you get than that? It's a dress watch. It's not a sports watch anymore. It's a dress watch. Even if I put it on rubber. Even if you put it on rubber, it's still a dress watch. Yeah, the days of the of the reverse of being a sports watch are long gone. You got super chats. Super chats, super chats. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Collecting fine art versus fine watches. Thoughts? I got to tell you, art is a cesspot of misery. Believe you me. There's so many fakes, and you need a lot of money to play in that game. Mm. I would tend to say you're much better off to stay in watches. Art. You can really lose your ass in art, believe you me. I I know about that. Mm -hmm. uh, I find watches. Hi, you buy Rolex, Omega, bit of Patek, you get out easily. You buy art. You might you might see to, to buy a good decent piece of art. You're going to have to spend fifty thousand dollars. Right, right. For what? Okay. Yep. So unless you got big big money, okay. Smoke Eater two dollars seventy nine. Moser three. Two zero zero dash one two zero four bracelet blue dial sports Moses a toxic brand. Well, Moses, Moses toxic. are so beautiful. P pull it up if you can. Pull that watch up. Let's take a look at let's, it. Let's get this baby I up on the Moser. screen here. Just just give me it's it's a Moser thirty two hundred, isn't it? Yep. Dash one two zero four. Uh, do I need the dash one two zero four? Mm-hmm. Okay, let's get this baby up on the screen now. I gotta be totally honest with you. I don't think it works. I think Moza is really gold or precious metal on a leather strap. I don't know if this sort of works. It's kind of a, uh, it's kind of Moses equivalent. Mm, I, I think that's. I'm sorry. Sexy. I I like it. Okay. I like it a lot. You like the bezel? I like the the bezel is is neutral, but I love the the Fume the dial. That, yeah, that's that's killer. How much are these? That I don't know. Let's I don't know. Have a look. Yeah, let's look. Let's on go Chrono shopping. 24. Let's go yep. shopping. Sounds let's, good. Let's go and have a look here. Here's one on Chrono. Fifteen thousand. You got to be joking. Twenty two Aussie. Fifteen US. You out of your mind? That's uh, a little steep. Ooh! A little fifth, steep. I mean, I mean, God's sake, you, you got to be joking, aren't you? That's mm. that's the paddock. I mean, ah, oh, that's crazy price. It's a good-looking sports watch, though. But, I mean, seriously, 22 Aussie, I mean, that's, that's I'm going to sell my paddock. I'm going to probably get for my paddock. I'll tell you what I'll get. 
mm-hmm. I'll probably get this will be selling 25 26,000 Aussie right. I want to buy a sports car you know that mm-hmm. I want to buy a car so a 20 and a Moser my god you'd never get your money back out of that thing would you could you imagine the humiliation if I bought that you'd never get your money back yeah See, you're, you're gonna take a hit for sure if we if we have a look at what's on for Moses see look at this so Look at this. This is this is what I think is Moser. Look at that. That's look at that. That is look at that. That is the beautiful blue mm-hmm. on the rubber rubber. Still a lot of money. Twenty five thousand. You've got to be joking. You got no resale. Resale wise, these are dang. This is dangerous territory. Okay. Come on, uh, you can't go there. It's dangerous. Yeah, you know buying this. Buying it new. Buying it new is not a good. Uh, is not a good idea. But it's it's a beautiful watch. Well, how much is twenty six thousand in real American dollars? About eighteen. About eighteen. Okay. 18. Hey Google, convert twenty six thousand Australian dollars into United States dollars. Twenty six thousand Australian dollars equals eighteen thousand six hundred and eight United States dollars and nineteen cents. That's a lot of money. That's, eighteen thousand real dollars. Ooh, that's a lot of money. Yeah. And this yeah. this midlife crisis of mine, it'll be gone before I've saved up the. De- <laughs> <laughs> I mean, come on, guys! I'm gonna make this realistic for the show. <clears throat> Showcase. Showcase watches two dollars. Glass hoot. Super Ocean. Black Bay 58 and Explorer 1. I think if you're 50 years old, you can't really do the Black Bay as your one-and-done sports watch. <clears throat> mm-hmm. I'm sorry. I don't think you can. Mm-hmm. I agree. Could you, imagine, could you imagine cruising the singles bar? Ah, oh, you got a Rolex. No, it's a Tudor. Ah, oh, who's Tudor? It's kind of like a poor man's Rolex. Uh, could you imagine more, that? As a, it's more geared as a pickup to, a, line. to the younger crowd. <clears throat> If you're in, uh, uh, approaching, you know, your 50s and you want a, a one and yeah, done. you got to have Rolex, man. Amiga Rolex, just one. get the Amiga, get the Amiga. Bobby, California, five bucks. Pontiff, what do you think of the Tudor Chrono Steel and Gold? i got to be honest with you. Mm. Hate it because they don't use real gold. It's yeah, it's rolled right. gold. Right. Okay, I'm sorry. It's, it's, it's. Yeah. It's really tacky. It's really you. You gotta buy Tudor. You don't get a two tone. You go steel. If you can afford two tone, get a Rolex. Exactly. <clears throat> Derek Mons Mon is five dollars. Thoughts on the new Omega Speedmaster Dark Side of the Moon Alingi that Hodinki posted today. What, what is, is this watch? Tell me yeah. what this is. What is this? Let's go I to Hodinki. Let, let's. Let's call know. it up. Let's get right. the hood inky, hood inky up there. Hood, hood inky. Mm-hmm. Let's get hood inky up. Let's go for it, man. So what's this new hood inky one? What, what did he post today? Where is it? Tell me where this is. Where is this watch? Omega Speed. Which watch were they talking about? Where, where the hell side, is it? Dark side of the moon. I don't see it. Omega dark side i can have a look at this stupid thing loading oh here it is ah oh, hate it hate it hate it hate it i don't who is that guy alingi who the hell is that i have no idea it's ceramic i don't like yeah. that sort of uh no 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 oh, it's america's cup actually that's quite cool actually that's very cool very yeah. cool tie-in oh we got that's the boat does it actually dry, fly like that i guess it must that's wow, pretty cool. a, that's pretty. Actually, it's very cool. Nah, I'd, I'd go. I'd, I, I don't. I'm not a. I, I'd like a steel case. I, I really do want steel sports. Yeah. For my midlife crisis, we've got to be a bit, uh, exactly. a bit more realistic. Okay. It is beautiful. Looking at it, gee, it's a young, it's a young man. If I was 35, yes, it's a I'm young 50. man's watch. Yep. yep. I'm yep. approaching 50. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. You missed a couple super chats. Oh, we did. You got to go, you gotta go ch- back to uh, Ichabod NYX. Ichabod, Ichabod NYX two dollars. Shave head and grow a goatee. Open a Miami store. Thank you. And then and got, uh, we've John got Reedy. John Reedy two pounds. Get a Lange, a Lange one or eighteen. See, I've already got the dress paddocks. You're doubling up. No point. I love that eighteen fifteen. What a beautiful watch that My is. My friend Dave has got one for sale. I know it. Fourteen does. and a half Aussie, which is like nine US. Mm. <clears throat> 
36 mil yellow gold box papers. Mm. But I've got paddocks. Paddocks, you, you either go paddock or lange. It's like, it, it's so... Look, I'm not a lange man, okay? I put my money into paddocks. So, right. I, I'm sorry. That's that's not... I want to steal sport. Something I can... But Bobby, Bobby, California. Okay, we've already done that right. one. Turkey and we've Volta. got turkey, turkey vulture. Let's get turkey vulture happening. Two dollars. I wear turkey vulture two bucks. I wear my Tudor when I'm depressed. I, I think Tudor's a great watch. <clears throat> It is. I tell you what I think a three-piece meal, combo meal, hunger buster would be. Right. Some sort of sports steel Rolex, mm -hmm. an Amiga Speedmaster Man on the Moon, and mm -hmm. a Tudor Black Bay. That would be a perfect three-piece combo. But you've got to have the Rolex to allow you to have the Tudor. Okay. Because when the bird, when you're at the singles bar and you say, oh, is that a Rolex? You go, no, I've got one at home. I actually have a few watches. I do have a Rolex. This is a Tudor, but I do have a Rolex. Do you want to come home and have a look? <laughs> That's what you want a pick up line. Do you want to come back to my place and take a look? Sure. That's like when you used to say, "Do you want to come back to my room to have a look at my etchings?" Mm -hmm. You know, you know, pencil etchings. You know, Picasso pencil etchings. Right. That's what you you do there with the art crowd, the New York crowd. Right. Ah, uh, I got to tell you seriously. I think, honestly, <clears throat> I'm going to relaunch a section, my midlife crisis, once I've lost another 10 kilos. Okay. My midlife crisis, we're going to get the sports car. Mm-hmm. I'm really looking at an MR2, just to cheese off. <laughs> just to cheese him off. And they're actually a pretty good car. That's the yeah, thing, they too. Are. They, are, they are pretty damn good. I've always loved... The MR2 was actually, when they were new, they were actually fairly expensive. They were always kind of, in my country, they were dear. Fantastic mid-engine sports car with Toyota reliability. How could you go wrong? Right. They're not a big engine car. No. It's not the donk. It's the handling that you buy the MR2 for. Right. Right. Here we yeah, go. Yankee Doodle, $2. I like one watch, one car, and multiple women. <laughs> That's the way to go, man. I'm more of a one-woman person. I don't like to... I, I, they do my head in, okay? I'll be completely right. honest with you. I can only do one wench at a time. It's trouble. It's trouble. Watches in giggles, two bucks. Arch, that was actually a good pickup line. Thank <laughs> you. Use it. You can use it if you like watches in giggles. Well, he's married and has a baby on the way, so hey, that's, that's not going to happen. Okay. Well, it's, it's in the off-season. Bit of side pussy. <laughs> it's... You go for it, chat. hey? Here we go. Charlie Hart again. Seven bucks for me. A Tudor and a Rolex and a and a the car pontiff. Yes, I I yeah. look. I think the problem with Rolex is. I, can I say this to you? Sure. Blue shirt. So many jerks have Rolex. They do. They so that's do. the big problem. I don't know if I want to go back. It's kind of like Porsche drivers. I mean, let's not get his sharp. No, not not his. I mean, uh, Tan involved because Tan's got a 911, and that's super cool. Right. But in my country, a lot of Porsche owners are real arrogant assholes. They're like real estate agents. You know, they think they're hot shit, but they're just jerks. You need a Rolex, Archie. You need I don't a Rolex. Know. I don't, you I... were, you've been spruiking it for so long. You need to get one back. And G, $2, Arch, thoughts on the Tudor Hydronaut? I actually own the Tudor Hydronaut. Yes. i got to be yeah. completely, totally honest with you. Angie, you don't remember the, the yeah. getting it from you, uh, in a Ian, drunk? Ian, I bought it drunk, drunk, remember? I bought it drunk from yep. Ian. Yep. i got to tell you the honest truth. That watch would have to be the ugliest damn. <laughs> that's why Tudor went broke. <clears throat> that's why they, they pulled out of the American market. Right. Yeah, the, the 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 second version of that watch was absolutely hideous. But the the, yes. the, the um, Austin has uh, the first version of it, and that's not bad. It's not a Actually, bad looking watch. Can I show you something? Sure. Can I show you something? I was going to show you. Um, I'm actually selling off. I'm trying to declutter my life. Right. Part of my mid midlife crisis. I'm actually selling a few things. I just want to. I just want to show you. Just hang on one tick there. Mm -hmm. We'll talk. We'll get Charlie on there in a minute. Thank God for pants, guys. Thank God for pants. Fuck. <clears throat> this.
this is my Rolex poster. Do you see my mm -hmm. Rolex poster? Yeah, very nice. I had this specially made years ago, mm -hmm. and it's got all the pre-ceramic sports watches that I liked. I had this mm -hmm. made up. I had Explorers, the Sub. Yep. These were all pre-ceramic, and also the gold and two tones. And I also had down as a tribute, I had Explorer 1. Mm-hmm. And I also had in the bottom corner a two-tone date just. Right. Now, i got to tell you, I'm actually going to sell this off. This was done. I just want to get my money back. That cost me 150 bucks. I want to sell it. I want to get rid of it because I'm just decluttering. So mm -hmm. there we go. Anyone in the Brisbane, because it's too expensive to post. Right. Anyone right. in Brisbane area, I mm -hmm. would sell that. I want to get my money back. I had it framed about 20 years ago. Can you believe that? Wow. That's I had it professionally ago. framed. I chose the wood. It cost me a fortune. Wayne Kerr, $2. Declutter, look behind you. It's the H. Don't think so. I am working on it, okay? I'm doing my tax figures at the moment, okay? Cut me. Some Slow but slack. sure. Slow but sure. So, here we go. <clears throat> we got Paul M. And there was another post here, sorry. Charlie said, I think Porsche says jerk more than Rolex, $7. Yeah, Porsche people just jerk. Uh, in my country, they're, they're, they're jerks. Not Tanzil, not Tanzil. He's got a 911, but it's different. Porsche people in my country are mainly boxster people. They can't mm -hmm. afford the 911, okay? 911 is different, okay? We can't yeah. afford... They're 280000 for a base model 911 in my country. Mm -hmm. Paul M, two pounds, 911, one paddock, a Speedy, a JLC Reverso, and a Sports Rolex. That could be... The problem is the 911. i got to be totally honest with you. Mm -hmm. I don't think I can afford the service or the upkeep of it. They are... Uh, no, you don't... I'd have to buy a 10-year-old one. For me to get a 911, 10 to 15 years old, even, okay, I'll be honest with you, the most I could stretch would be a Cayman, a used Cayman. Just okay? get a, a just get a Miata or an MR2. You don't need a Porsche. I, I want to go no. Japanese. The Japanese, yeah. they make reliable shit, okay, and I can get my money back when this stupid midlife crisis ends, okay? Yeah. When I need to get a minivan! A minivan! Yeah. Don't invest too heavily in a car. Just, just... <coughs> stick to watches. Stick to exactly, sports. exactly, exactly. That's exactly it. So, I, I I thought about the Porsche thing, but okay, here we go. We got Charlie Hartman, seven bucks. Audi RS4 first gen. Audis. I love Audis. I love Audis. The problem is, they are they're beautiful cars. Audi is a beautiful car. Mm, Horrendous running costs. Okay, they're Volkswagen. They're owned by the biggest bunch of fires known to man. Did you not remember Dieselgate? <laughs> Do you guys not remember Dieselgate? That's the same company, okay? Mm -hmm. you, you don't want to be dealing with the Germans, okay? Believe you me, mm -hmm. I, I honestly, you know the other, you know what my dream car would be? What's that? Honda mm -hmm. NSX. Okay. Here in the States, it was an Acura. Yeah, it, it, you know, the NSX was a supercar. This was, was, mm -hmm. was yep. it, it, the yep. car yep. that made Ferrari pull its game up. That right. car changed Ferrari more than anything. Yeah, it was a very it, cool car. Yeah, they, they are a bit expensive, and NSX would be so cool. No storage space, absolutely no practicality, but that's... Ex the other great car, which I really do like, is a Honda S2000. I don't know if you guys had that in America. We the did, S the, little, the little convertible. Yeah, we had it. Yeah, yep. yeah. And, and th they were a naturally aspirated two-liter engine. They had a lot of punch. A lot of right. punch. Yeah. Uh, I, I wouldn't go Subaru WRX. I think that's a bit, ooh, boy uh, racer. Yeah, it's not... You, that's not. That's a young man's car. Uh, that, that's, that's Wayne not, uh, Kerr, $5. I got a 2020 Audi A6 3-liter T. Maintenance covered for six years. Great car. In Australia, we don't have that. We've only got a two-year warranty. Mm -hmm. Really? Yeah, wow. it's crap. We're, we're, we're really... 
they, they treat us like garbage. <laughs> Eric made two dollars. My 911 is still what, worth what I paid four years. Hey, but I don't have the service costs. You buy, okay, I could, you, you buy a 911, hundred thousand dollars. I don't want to put a hundred in. I'm gonna put, I want to put ten to twenty in. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You buy a 911, I could easily have a $10,000 service. I can't afford that. I barely make a living out of this YouTube crap. Okay? <laughs> so Eric Med is right. <clears throat> Eric right. Med, I think he's a doctor. Med, Eric Medicine, he's a doctor, right? Well, you can afford that stuff, right? I can't. Right. You know what tires cost for a 911? Do you, you honestly know what the brake pads cost, the calipers? Screw that. What about an oil change is like 500 bucks? <clears throat> Eric Hart Garden, seven dollars. You loved your three one eight, and I love my three two eight. Yes, I did love my E thirty, but you know what? Plastic water pump, plastic water pump, plastic, plastic, plastic. I will never ever buy a BMW. They, Scotty Kilmer, Scotty Kilmer, Scotty Kilmer. I actually saw a beautiful Z four the other day. You can buy a nice ten year old Z four reason of trump change mm -hmm. but it's the running cost that will kill me the miata won't do that to me you understand right you understand don't you come on work with me <laughs> i gotta be able to run this down my honda's got 175,000 kilometers yep. same engine same transmission all i've done is oil filters and brake pads and, and rotors that is it and you yep. know what four tires for my honda cost me Three hundred and fifty dollars for four new tires, and th and those I got Yokohamas, Yokies. I got good quality tire. Right, right. You didn't get them. Come from, on, uh, man. Glenn, the truck tire guy. Yes, Glenn. I can get. I don't know what's happened to Glenn. I think he may not be with us. Oh, that's so sad to hear that. That three D print and watch guy, five bucks. Go for a GP. Go to a GP and get a referral for mental health treatment. You clearly are not well. If not for yourself, do it. Well, i got to be honest with you. They want to pump me full of drugs. I don't want to take drugs. Right. Have you gone back to the psychologist yet? To be honest with you, I didn't like what he was saying. He was blaming me! <laughs> it's not my fault! Of course. I don't want to hear that! I came there so you could give me... Validation! You're supposed to say, Oh, Archie, we're very sorry. Yes! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Instead, he said, Do you think it could be some of the actions you've done? Do you think maybe these women could have got upset with some of the promises you made? That's what he right. said to me. I don't want to hear that shit. How dare If you. I wanted to hear that shit, I'm going to talk to my old man. Right. For free. Right. <laughs> I don't want to hear that. <laughs> I want to lay the blame and move on. <laughs> yeah, well, you gotta, uh, you gotta give AC two a call and uh, set up a barbecue. I mean, with come a, on, man, you can't together. blame me. What did I do wrong? You know, I, I, I just, I don't, I want validation. It's like getting a watch review. I want you to tell me my collection's amazing and 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 don't worry, it's good value. You paid retail for. for you paid retail for Zenith. It's all cool, man. That's what you want. Validation. Come on, man. Not that it's garbage. <clears throat> well, it's not garbage, but you never get your money back. You know. Right. Yes. I mean, come on, come on. I want validation. I want. I want to. I want to lay the blame with someone else and move on. <laughs> you know, it's never. I wonder what you think I want. I don't want the truth. I don't want the truth. I'm paying you to kiss my ass and tell me it's not my fault. <laughs> hey, what do you think it is? I mean, come on, man. What, what, what do we think I'm here for? I want you to say it was all her, all these women's fault. They were bad. They lied to me. Of course. You got some super I don't chat. want to hear the truth. <laughs> you okay, can't handle chat. the truth. <clears throat> you can't handle the truth. I don't need that. I don't need that psycho mumbo. I just go and watch Dr. Phil for four hours. I go and watch Dr. Phil on YouTube. You know that? He's pretty cool. Right. I love Dr. Phil, by the way. I really do. He's yeah. he's also from Oklahoma, I think, wasn't he? Uh, I don't need to hear the I truth. Don't I don't want to hear that thrown at me. Just, just, just go away. Right. <clears throat> I'm the victim. 
tell me what I want to hear. <laughs> exactly. You understand, don't you? You, you know do. where I'm coming from. I do. I do. Blue Sorry. Chef, we've got ten more minutes. We're gonna. This is an hour show. I've had such oh, wow. a good time with you. You are a great host. I love doing shows with you. Oh, thank you. Uh, I gotta tell you, seriously. Let me put my poster back. It's, I'm sick of holding it. Just hang on there. I'm gonna put this All back right. in my room. James, you owe me. You owe me big time. <sighs> Again, thank God for pants, guys. My pants fell off. You see that? <laughs> we saw, I just went, saw, we, you, the whole world saw it. Yes. <laughs> <clears throat> There's nothing well, rude there. I've got undies on. Thank God, no, you know, nobody's yeah, watching. Yeah, this is why I had so. the sponsorship thing there. No, it's all cool. Look, seriously, man, I got to tell you, I really wanna, I really wanna get myself into shape. Sounds good. And uh, get a what I'd like to do is, I'd like to find a man on the moon. I'd like to find another... a very wealthy Asian lady who. Right. Uh, I'm looking for someone in the five to ten million dollar category. Nice. That's what I'd nice. like. Nice. Because I, I think but... like this is my last pitch. Okay. Yeah, but just One this, time, pitch. this time don't forget to leave out the uh, oh uh, by the way I'm still married part. I think I'll just say I'm separated in my profile. What do you reckon? There you go. There you by go. the way, guys, if you subscribe now to Patreon, I will actually reveal my profile. I will give you a link to my profile, and you'll be able to give me pointers on picking up the wenches. There you go. Showcase watches two two pounds. Bruce, you're a trooper. Absolutely, Thank I you, like James. that bulldog. Thank you, James. We've got nine minutes to eight and a half minutes to go. James, any advice you could give me as a learned man? What could you give me? Give me some advice. Uh, James or me? You, me. Give me, me? advice. You, you give me advice. Give me uh, advice. Uh, okay. Blue uh, shirt. Again. Get rid you of. You know the... me. You know me well. Give me some advice. Okay. Get rid of one of the paddocks. Get a okay. small little con get a small little Japanese convertible. Yep. Get, get a man on the moon. Yep. Then down the road get. Do you, a, do you mind if I got a Mark II, a Speedmaster Mark II? If I can't get a Speedy. Sure, sure. I, I, I mean, the man on the moon is your is your iconic watch, but if you okay, want to. Okay, we'll just see see what the price is. I'm always a bargain you, shopper. I'm you looking for value. Mix, you want to mix it up a little and 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 and. <laughs> Get a Mark II, then get a Mark II. But at okay, least okay. You'll have what a other advice? Use. What other advice? Rolex, 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 Rolex. You need a Rolex. Well, what about what about the lady? Where do I get this lady from? I'm trying to find this oh. lady. Yeah, you might be able to sneak the lady in there at some point. Okay, okay, okay. No. Um, See, if I get just, the lady, she might buy me a Rolex for my birthday. They, what do you think yeah. of that one? What do you think that of that be, one? See, that I'm thinking big better. picture. Yep. I like it. I like your thing. Yeah, that's what I that's what I think too. Yeah. I'd like a day date, forty mil day date with diamond yes. dial. Yes. What do you oh. reckon? Oh. Yeah, that's what I want, man. Schmicko, schmicko, schmicko. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I'd love that. I really would love that. Green dial with Romans would be cool as well. You nice. know, that olivey green, just loaded sort of look. Yeah, yeah. I'd love that it, man. That's, They're about uh, forty grand, brand new. Yes, they are. If there's ladies watching in the audience, forty thousand. But I got friends who can get it cheaper. There you go. There you go. Guys, I gotta tell you, man. Seriously, we're gonna reboot Archie Luxury: The Midlife Crisis. It's gonna mm -hmm. happen soon. It's gonna be a great syndicated series. If you've got any mm -hmm. products you want to target to men going through midlife crisis, now it's time to do the advertising tie-ins with me so you can ride this wave, okay? There you so go. you've got a product, you got a service, hey, I'll spruik it. Got a reverse mortgage you want to spruik? I'll sell anything. I don't mind. Just just you, pay you, me you enough. I'll you do still it. got fridge space, uh, right? Well, I'm looking at more longer-term advertisers like, okay. um, you know, like the ads I'm running for Aspeciate, you know, Aspeciate, that app. Abstantiate, yep. Abstantiate, that's the one, that's the one, and the David S. W. and the, that that stupid watch, you know, that other watch. Yes. What's that, tint. Tint? tint? tint, yeah. That's okay, they pay this money, what do I care? Thomas okay, G. Thomas G, five pounds, get an old German limousine, very comfortable, 
and you can always say you bought it new. Japanese car has no luxury. Look, do you know what a German limousine costs to run? My God. Mm. I got a friend of mine's got a Mercedes Benz 600. You know, the old 600s, right. like from the 1960s. Mm -hmm. Believe you me, they are not cheap. Air suspension, 6.3 liter V8. That thing mm -hmm. is a money pit. Mr. C, $1. Thank you. And Ian Arnold, five pounds. How best to buy a Lange Saxonia? Second hand, 10 years plus or new? You've got to buy Lange used. You do yes. not buy Lange Correct. new. That's and I wouldn't just problem. concentrate on a Saxonia. Get look at an 1815. Mm -hmm. You have a couple of models, and whichever Lange one is one. the good. Yep. Yeah, a couple of bang per buck. It's bang per buck. It doesn't matter which model it is. It's bang per buck. That's all we exactly. care about is the money. And we got Yankee Doodle. We've got four and a half minutes to go. Yankee Doodle, two dollars. Get an old taxi with fiddly bits. <laughs> you know what? Blue shirt. Can I tell you this? Yes, sir. Okay, so I went back on the dating scene. This is when I met my Japanese wife. Right. You want to know something? I had more success with women when I had an ex-yellow cab mm -hmm. than I ever when I had the 3 Series. They thought I was an arrogant shit when I had the mm -hmm. 3 Series. And I was. I was arrogant. Right, right. You know? Um, oh, you know, I just had a thought. You know, it's if mm. you're back on the dating scene now... Maybe... Well, not yet. i got to lose a bit more. I want to lose a bit more. I want to sell okay. the paddock, get the car... Get the sports Amiga. Mm -hmm. We're going to do the well, whole thing. And I want to tie in with advertisers who are going to promote products to help this segment. Right. But maybe instead of the Speedy and maybe wait on the car a little bit, but get a bluesy again, and that'll help with the ladies. Ah, uh, it's too cliche. I'm sorry. No. You love that bluesy. That bluesy looks so good on you. Yeah, but it's it's... It's, uh, nothing, I kind of cringe. I like a bluesy. I, I know, but I cringe. Okay? I'm not going for young 20 year old women, okay? I'm not going, I want, I'm the gold digger, I'm not the gold diggy. Okay, right, it's a difference. Right, right. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm the gold digger, not the other way around. Do you understand? Of course, of course. Of course. I want to be the kept man. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay, that's why I go after substantially older, attractive, wealthy women. There you go. Okay. Does that That's make sense to you? It does. It does. Oh, come on. Wake up. Smell the coffee. I want to go on a cruise ship called The World. I'd like someone who preferably... If there's any 70 to 80-year-old women who have a suite on The World that's a cruise mm -hmm. ship that never stops, mm -hmm. I'm your man. <laughs> I can be perfect arm candy for you. I can make you feel special. I can make you feel amazing. I'm here for you. We've got... Fukin... Dublick, $10, Big Dick Energy, profile header for your dating app, success. I don't know. See, I'm, I'm my target is different, see? I'm mm -hmm. not so well endowed. I must confess, the reason I go after Asians, mm -hmm. because, you know, even though I'm larger proportion other size, I'm probably not the greatest size in the sack. So you've got to find one that fits you well. So in there all honesty... Go. All honesty, no, that's not the answer for me. I, mm. I'm not, I'm not, I don't want to use, you know, the penile pumps and, ah, oh, I, I got a lot of, everyone's got, everyone's got body issues, you know, I'd just rather have a nice, nice lady, Asian with $10 million who just loves me. That's all I want. That works. Ten that's to not 20, a lot to ask. 10 to 20 and um, I'm your man, 10 mm -hmm. to 20 million. US would be better. Of course. I'd settle for Aussie pesos too. Okay. All right. I just want to be looked after, kept, you know, maintained and... I understand. I, I don't want to work. I don't want to work, you know. I don't like working. I just want to do a, super, a live show every day, shit like that, dress up, you know. There you go. Go in the heated swimming pool, float around, take the Bentley out. Nice. Go private on a jet. Very nice. Yeah, that's kind of what I want, you know. Yep. Yep. I'll make them feel good, feel special, do everything they want. We've got 30 seconds. We're going to wrap this baby up. I want to thank you for coming on here. You're welcome. I really do want to thank you. Let's let's keep talking. We're going to do a show tomorrow. Keep the watches happening. Watches and giggles, two bucks. 
It's the motion of the ocean that causes commotion. Thank you so much there. <laughs> And guys, keep watching the videos. I had a very good video I put up yesterday, why I hate the popular model Rolexes. Did you see that one? I did. What did you think? It was good. Your 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 videos as of late have been really good. I think he's a bit of a dick. He's got every popular one. I mean, it's okay to have one popular Rolex, but do you need yep. all of them? Right. It's just right. desperately, look at me, look at me, look at me. <clears throat> right. It's the gold Submariner in a Porsche with the gold chains. It just mm -hmm. smells of pimp. Right. <laughs> it's not a nice look. It really isn't cool, okay? Can I say that to you? You can. It really is not cool to have all the hot Rolex. You can have one, right? but to have all of them, it just screams. It just yeah. screams. Uh, right. Have a, have a Milgauss, have an Explorer 1. Yeah, have, have, a, have a date just. Right. You know, but exactly. you have to have every popular model. It just makes me vomit, you know. Let's wrap this baby up there. Um, let's wrap it up and we'll see you in the next one. There we go. That was a great, care, great show, man. That was a good 